That's right, we're gonna have a guest today. The old Gabster is gonna come with us. We're gonna put some fish in the boat. Here we go. Thanks for watching Three Pound Fishing, partnered up with these fantastic companies. All right, folks, welcome back to another fantastic episode at Three Pound Fishing. We're joined by our super guest, Gabby, right here. Gabby's just gonna keep looking. Gabby, stop looking on the, the, the dead fish. Gabby. For those that have been around, no Gabby. Gabby's been around for a while. She has gone fishing with Three Pound Fishing. She's never been a great guest on, on the show, but she will be around in this episode. So anyway, we're gonna, it's an evening fish. It's gonna be a smoker tomorrow, 100 degrees. So we're going out here. We're still a little, short little outing and uh, drop on some of these piles before that heat happens. So I appreciate you guys watching. Let's get it on. We've added a lot of different minnow colors just recently. Got this guy right here. I forgot the names to be quite honest with you. You have to go to the website, but look at that thing pop. This is called Shad, and this thing has been on fire. In fact, we'll fish with that right off the bat. But I chose these based off of their colors, how they look. I think they're gonna be awesome. And they have been. On the guide trips, they have been smoking. Especially the Shad color one. The Shad color one has really been hot. So I'm gonna take off the old pad of tail, which has been doing great. But sometimes those fish, for whatever reason, they want your standard minnow bait. All right, this picture right there does not get any better. I mean, I fully expect some major action to come out of that pile. your first fish bam that was easy how many can we get on this active that's a good fish man that's a starter right there that is a starter solid 12 incher fatty that shad first drop we letting them go because that's what we do gabby's just back there having a blast Everybody's out here on the lake still because everybody knows that heat's about to come on. Oh, I came up short. Now, if I come up and short, just like you're seeing here, I will try to grab anything on the sides, um, which I really came up too short. So we're going to do that again. Now that is a good cast. That thing should be coming right in the heart of it, which it is. And I'm telling you, this bait has been popping. So I'm fishing with a 10 foot Ozark rod. I can't say enough good things about that. This is the optimal sniping braid. It is freaking smoking awesome. But I also recommend the uh, Optimize. I think it's awesome. So, but on my home lake, this is what I fish with. And they took the plastic off of it. All right, we're gonna pause that real quick here. They took the plastic. They wanted it so bad, they took the plastic. I am going with the regular pink 132nd ounce head. I supplement that with a number seven split shot. That is always my rig for the most part. All right, this is the red, white, and blue. I bet you this guy is pretty darn good too. So we're gonna go with the red, white, and blue. Just because I know that shad bait is working. I didn't fish with the red, white, and blue all day today. Um, and I'm assuming it's gonna work out fine. It's natural color, it makes sense. Oh, there's the red, white, and blue. Now that's awesome. So our next tournament you're gonna to see a three pound fishing ad is gonna be the Truman crappie usa and then the championships good fish and uh, possibly the one man crappie masters event i am seriously considering that i think that would be fun to share that experience with everybody um, so i'm debating it it actually might happen oh. the red white and blue is working Ooh, look at that that is 
That is quite possibly one of the largest red ear that I've caught out of this lake. I know it's not that big compared to what other people get, but I'm telling you right now, we do not catch big red ear or bluegill on this lake. At least I don't. I'll always say that I am not a big fisherman, but we just got him. That was a good one too. found my my next year's bluegill spot check out that good fish let's go see if Gabby likes this fish let's see Cause that's a good fish right there. That's a good fish. Gabby, Gabby. She doesn't like the fishies. I don't know what to say about that. Other than we'll let this guy go. Oop. What a beautiful night, man. Minus the wreck boats out here. It's a great night. It's a great night. So, don't forget we got paddle tails. I'm just taking stuff out of this bag. Sniping braid. We got everything on the website now. It's crazy and it's growing. Some highlights. The multi-packs on 1 16th or 1 32nd. I'm sure I'll have 1 8th out shortly. Are incredible buys. So are the pro packs of the paddle tails. Check them out. Gabby, what do you think? What do you think? You think they're good? Yeah, uh huh. Yeah. My co captain says, absolutely. Fluger reels, that's what I'm using right now. 20s. Got my 8616 up there rocking it. See you in Truman. Thanks for watching. Short episode, but I think we got a lot out of it, man. We're dropping. The temps are skyrocketing. No doubt about it. But guide trips are on fire, so book now, as like I say. So, thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for watching Three Pound Fishing, partnered up with these fantastic companies.